Hi friends, this is Shaji. Today's section I am going to install and configuring iOS web server. Let's get started. Open server manager and click on add roles and features. Click on next and select role based installation and next and select the web server IES and tick mark on that and click on add features and click on next if you wish you can add .NET Framework 3.5 future .NET Framework 3.5 is not directly required for running IS so we can install later click on next next here we can add some roles based on your requirement depending on what you want to do you may want to add some more uh, roles click on next and tick mark the restart option if it's required then click on install installation is completed so open ISS manager select your domain so mine is DC2 and expand that then click on site there is already one default site is there so just click on that click on browse so it will appear the default site the default ISS site is working so now I am going to create new site before heading to installation we need to create DNS records open DNS click on forward lookup zone expand that then select your domain mine is text.com so click on that right click and select new host A or AAA record enter the following details host name and IP address my host name is sysadmin uh, fully qualified name is sysadmin.test.com IP address is my local IP 192.168.1.40 then add host a record maps a domain name to IP address of the computer hosting domain we create a DNS record so let's check that open CMD then ping to sysadmin so now I am able to access this sysadmin from command prompt close everything open IS manager and click on site and select add new website site name is sysadmin.test.com and select the physical path so I haven't created so click on file manager select any drive so I have only one drive so I'm just clicking C drive then create a new folder you can give any name so I'm just giving sysadmin you can copy any HTML file inside that but I have already downloaded some files so I'm just copying to inside that sysadmin we need to add some permission for that folder so right click on property and click on security and edit and click on add then add ISS user click on apply and ok so we need to add this path to the IES site click on physical path then add that path click on that C drive insert C that add that folder select your IP address so port number is 80 default so I am just using 81 then copy paste that site name to host name click on ok so website is created so I am just double checking that settings click on binding so here it will display the host name port number and IP address detail click on browse so it will redirect to our website as we can see that website is working thanks for watching this video